What is going on? My name is Abu and welcome to another video. If this is your first time here and you want to develop your skills in HTML, CSS and JavaScript from the ground up to the expert level, start now by subscribing and clicking the bell so you don't miss anything. Okay, so in this lecture, I'm going to teach you how keyboard tag works in HTML and how to use it properly. Before you decide to mark up your text content using keyboard tag, you need to answer this question. Do you have keyboard name in your text content? If yes, then you can use keyboard tag to mark them up. Now, let's write some code and learn how to use keyboard tag properly. Here I opened up the HTML document I created for this lecture using Visual Studio Code. On line 17, I have a sentence and it's saying that Press Ctrl S to save your chains. And there are two keyboard names in this sentence. The first one is CTRL, stands for Control, and the second one is S. It's a letter S on the keyboard. So let's mark them up using keyboard tag. Let's do the Control first. The opening keyboard tag looks like this, starting with left angle bracket, K, B, D, and right angle bracket. And a closing keyboard tag looks like this, starting with the left angle bracket, forward slash, K, B, D, and right angle bracket. And next, opening keyboard tag here, and closing keyboard tag here. Now, I'm going to save this, and let's try this up in the browser and see how they look. Okay, it worked. As you can see, now all the keyboard names are marked up using keyboard tag look different compared to other text contents. That is how browsers render text content marked up using keyboard tag. But it doesn't mean you can use keyboard tag when you only want to make your text look different. Use CSS styling if you only want to make part of your text content looks different compared to other text content. Now, if you started learning HTML and you want to master when and how to use every different HTML tag, make sure you check out this playlist and it has everything you need to master different HTML tags. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time.